Are you guys ready? Arataki numero uno ito here in the flesh. <laughs> ito, it's time to, for you to uh, uh, get ready because. Uh, Look at, look at the Zhang Ling title. Chang Crush More. Wait, wait. Let me, let me see this. Chang Crush More's companion, God of Trickery. And Chalamitous Colossus Chang Crush More. Chalamitous Colossus. I'm having a. Uh, I'm having. The Legend of the Legend of Zelda of Zelda uh, flashbacks here with a uh, calamity Ganon. Don't underestimate the beetle. He can be some of the toughest little guys around. All right. Yes, you can. Yes, you can. Want to know what's on this beetle's diet? Sweat and tears. That's what. That's how it I'll gets him stronger. So I, have a quote. I think we can all learn something from that. It's time. Hey, How's Wobba. It going? Having fun? <laughs> hey, John Lee. Chang Ling, Wobba, you finally made it. Well, Bolchuk is certainly having a blast. <laughs> yeah, he does. The day has finally come. All right. Wobba san, I've been training hard. Yarataki Blazing Armor Beetle Battle Boot Camp. Now I want to show you just how far I've come. Uh, and Crimson Staff, too. <laughs> if my progress satisfies you, then please, teach me! Show me the way to communicate with Crimson <laughs> Staff, Crystal Tornado, and all the shelled organisms of this world. <laughs> I, I don't- I don't take him seriously, though. I mean, he- he's Ito. He's awesome. <laughs> Do that, and I swear, once I become the reigning champion of the beetle fighting world, I will build a mighty statue in your image at the Arataki Gang's beetle fighting headquarters. Well, um, not to rain on your parade, Ito, but, um, it seems like, uh, this little guy here, Gwoba, already has a statue dedicated to him. Uh, uh, it's, it, it references more like. You know, the god of stove. But yeah, another statue. Why not? Yes. Alright. So that, um, that's his, uh, beetle. What the? Wobasan got a brand new Onikabuto. Mm hmm. Onikabuto, yeah. That does not look normal. Oh, it does not. Oh, it appears to be not a typical Onikabuto shell, but one built of resilient wood. Is it wearing a suit of armor? So it's our defense? Oh. We told Granny all about your Onikabuto boot oh, camp. No. <laughs> it really piqued her interest when she heard that Wobo was getting a disciple. Okay. As it turned out, a friend of hers had made a whole bunch of gardening and landscaping machines to look after the silk flowers on the terrace. They're called bloom pruners. Bloom pruners. The bloom pruner can transform into the shape of any creature to blend into its environment. Squirrels, butterflies, finches, you name it. And of course, Onikabuto too. Okay, so it's a machine that transforms into any creatures? Or into the shape of any creatures. So, Master gave Boba <coughs> a bloom pruner and got it to take the form of an Onikabuto so it can battle against you. Thank you, Madame Payne. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> That's pretty high tech for a gardening appliance. Yeah, but I mean, what would you, what would you expect if it's the that tie? Yeah. So Madam King's friend. Ah, uh, uh, of course. Yeah, of course. Cloud retainer, obviously. Zip it. Don't spoil it. No machine can compare to a real live Oni Kabuto warrior. 
Did Guobasan pick a dumbed down enemy on purpose so we can showcase all our awesome skills? <laughs> yeah. You may be wise to temper your optimism, Oni King. My beetle senses are failing to detect this Oni Kabuto's might. Or perhaps it's too profound for me to fathom. Nani? <laughs> um, yep. I guess uh, this is the ultimate trial, guys. It's not even alive. There's nothing for you to sense. Uh, anyway, Guobasan may possess limitless power, but a warrior needs to be one with his weapon. The bond between Oni Kabuto and Trainer is forged through blood, but sweat, sweat and, and tears. tears. That's what. Wood, mesh, and gears. <laughs> <laughs> Crimson Staff and I are like glove and fist. Ooh. I I never noticed um, the bandage. The bandages that that <laughs> Jean-Lin has on her knee, on her right knee. Let's get this duel going. It's time for Guobasan to witness my true potential once and for all. Oh yeah. Dude. Do it on the stage. <laughs> Crying out loud. Okay, so this is the ultimate trial of the strong. Only oh, chapter properties. Let's see what we're in for, guys. <clears throat> An all-round developed Anuchabuto shaped machine. It's extremely powerful in combat at all ranges. It can attack with consecutive earthquakes. It can attack with various electro attacks. Enhanced resistance to interruption. Medium movement speed. Okay, well, if you haven't done so already, guys, make sure to leave a like, because I'm gonna need it to fight Gobasan here. This, uh, yeah, this calamitous colossus uh, count that is with a uh, an Amichabuto, uh shaped machine. Designed by Cloud Retainer. But yeah. Okay. Well, um, let's see what I'm in for. <clears throat> yep. Ouch. Fortunately. There. Okay. This one is quite easy for now, at the very least. I'm sure it will be even... Uh, there? Okay. Oh, ouch! Okay. So this is the resistance. Oh! Uh, one, two, three. Yes! <laughs> Grovasan, thank you for the fight. It was awesome. I learned a lot. Whoa, Bull Checker sure made short work of the Bloom Pruner. Oh, yeah, uh, Ito was fighting, so. Yeah, I'm just going to impersonate Ito here. Um, <laughs> hey, Grobasan, that was some sweet, sweet beetle fighting here. <laughs> look, at, look at these guys. <laughs> Tra the traveler throws up his like, huh? While Paimon. Oh no. I won! Victory is mine! With my trusty Crimson Staff, I have defeated the mighty Guobasan! Mighty Guobasan. Calamitous Colossus, Town Crushmore. Alrighty then. <laughs> the moment I've been waiting for. 
Quobasan, if I ever earned your recognition, <laughs> what? I humbly ask you to teach me the ways of shelled organism communication. <laughs> Nani? Um, I, I don't know what you're saying. Uh, sure, okay. Uh, huh? Quobasan, you look pleased? But you just lost to me in battle. Yeah, but it's not about losing or fighting. It's a uh, it's, it's not about losing or winning, it's about fight, the excitement, the frills. Does this mean you're proud of me for my swift progress? Oh, shucks. <laughs> I don't know what to say. <laughs> you're too kind, Wobasan. Oh, you're just being modest. I know you were going easy on me. <laughs> it looks like Wobas all warmed up now. The Bloom Pruner is ready to operate at full power. What do you, what, what do you mean at full power? Boba, remember the plan? In this round, we want to increase the Bloom Pruner's power output from a tenth of a percent to one percent, okay? <laughs> Any higher and you'll risk knocking Ito's <clears throat> baby Kabuto out cold. Uh... Uh-oh. Uh, Uh-oh, SpaghettiOs. <laughs> Yep. <laughs> what? A tenth of a percent? As I feared, we have barely scratched the surface. It seems like it, yeah. Wait, hold on a minute. Mm -hmm. A tenth of one percent? As in zero point one percent? <laughs> as in one one thousand? <laughs> yes. You gotta be kidding me! All that was just one one thousandth of its top power. Globa's <laughs> 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 a little confused. You did say you wanted to train your Oni Kabuto to defeat Crystal Tornado, correct? I thought it would go without saying, given the size. The Bloom Pruner has to shift rocks the size of casserole dishes. So obviously it has to be pretty strong. Uh -huh. Even then, Crystal Tornado is bigger still. It dwarfs me and Guoba, and it's even taller than you. It's impossible. If we were talking, oh, twice as strong as the last fight, I think I'd have a shot. Ten times as strong, and we're already looking at losing most, if not all, of the time. About a thousand times stronger? Who am I kidding? It's hopeless. <laughs> when your tactics fail, you have to change your point of view. In our journeys far and wide, we often have to think on our feet. <laughs> what is this flashback? And <laughs> Pamela's voice here. Clinging to old methods can never solve the problem, no matter how hard you try. Shout out to the voice actors, though. They do an amazing job, as always. Of course, Kwobasan. This is what you've been trying to tell me all along. I gotta study mechanics. Nani? Then build a suit of armor for Crimson Staff that'll take his abilities to a whole new level. Or maybe, heck, I, I could build a bigger, stronger mechanical Oni Kabuto, piloted by Crimson Staff under my direction. <gasps> An Oni Kabuto piloting a mechanical Oni Kabuto? Oh, wait, wait, wait. How do you expect to pull that off? <laughs> Does that even still count as a beetle battle? Uh, hey, I believe in my bro. Yeah, he'll find a way, as always. Seeing the power of Bloom Pruner has made me realize something. There's a natural limit to Oni Kabuto's strength. Mm -hmm. People have tried to tell me this before. Shinobu, the Grand Master, especially Sky Cleaving White Iron Lavender Melon. Admitting defeat is shameful, but not even trying to mix up your tactics one time? That's just plain stupid! Yeah, definitely. Wobasan has shown me a new path. Mechanically modified Oni Kabuto. So, <laughs> is that going to be a thing for the next uh, Beetle Battle boot camp? Mechanically modified Oni Kabutos. Okay. 
With this new technique in my arsenal, size will be no obstacle to me and my valiant beetle warriors as we set out to beat Crystal Tornado once and for all. Uh -huh. I don't understand. <laughs> Looks like Woba's not too sure about all that. Yeah. Mechanics, huh? Hmm. I'd have to get my master to see if her friend would be willing to help. She's, She's the, the expert. expert. <laughs> yeah. And we also... <laughs> it's, it's crazy. We're also getting, um... So, Zhang Yu, which is a uh, cloud trainer for Nets Patch. So they are teasing her as a playable character. Did you say expert? Please, Obasan, <coughs> Chef Sama, my savior. Chef Sama. Introduce me. Introduce me. Uh huh. Uh oh. Thinking of becoming the second Arataki gang member to study in Liyue, are you, boss? <laughs> Shinobu, when'd you get back? I've never left. <laughs> Time's up. We spent our last mora on these boat tickets. And if we don't get to the harbor pronto, we'll go to waste. But, 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 I, give me a minute, okay? We're, we're, we're in the middle of an extremely important discussion here. Yeah, I heard. <laughs> yeah, she definitely heard. I was actually very pleased to hear the suggestion of you doing some sort of studying coming out of your own mouth. Yeah, that's true. I have some relevant experience, so I can write a little booklet to get you started. But unfortunately, studying in Liyue is very expensive. The Arataki Gang's typical expenditures are a drop in the ocean by comparison. Yeah. So, what do you intend to do about it? It'll be fine. I'll just... Uh... I'll work like a horse when I get back to Inazuma. I know what I'm getting into here, all right? Uh -huh. I got it all planned out in my head. It's not like I've never gotten paid work before. As soon as I get earning, we'll all have cash for the burning. <laughs> <laughs> as soon as I get earning, we'll all have cash for the burning. <laughs> And don't think for one second I'll be abandoning you or the rest of the Arataki gang, neither. I ain't the kind of head honcho that runs off to go study and leaves his gang behind. I don't know. This is not the Arataki way. If we're gonna study, we do it as a team. Once I've got enough mora for everyone's tuition fees, <clears throat> the whole Arataki gang is coming to Liyue. We'll study together, learn some epic new skills together, come out the other side as the stronger, smarter, invincible Arataki gang. <laughs> okay, sure. You're saying all of the right things. Uh, who are you and what have you done with Boss? Uh, I mean, when he's excited about something, he'll go above and beyond. Wow, bull chucker. Those are some bold words. You better make sure you follow through. Uh, yeah. But, hey, don't you remember? Aratachi numero uno Ito is a man of his word. He'll never back down from a challenge. <laughs> of course, I, uh, I still need to iron out some deeds in terms of what kind of work I can get and how much I can break in per day, but... Yeah. yeah. <laughs> in that case, Oni King, I'll stay here in Liwe. Firstly, this will enable me to follow up with Chef Sama and discuss our study plans in detail. Chef Sama. Secondly, now that word of the Arataki Blazing Armor Beetle Battle Boot Camp has begun to spread, I'll be able to scout for talented warriors and continue optimizing the Oni Kabuto training diet. Uh -huh. Also, if the Oni King's right hand and sky cleaving white iron lavender melon wish to continue battling or analyze the battle so far, I'll be here to support them. Okay. Awesome. Good thinking, Grandmaster. So Grandmaster Anakado is going to stay in Liyue to prepare for the next Beetle Battle Boot Camp. While Ito is going back to Inazuma to to do some paid work so that the whole gang could go studying here in Liyue and also fight <laughs> with uh, beetles. Okay, standard procedure challenges. applies. I'll let your grandpops know what you're up to so we won't worry about you. 
<laughs> Man, I am so pumped to see what you'll have for us next time I see you. <laughs> I do need to make one thing clear, though. I can't promise that we'll be able to talk an Adeptus into taking you on as students. <laughs> Kenzie and I will do our best, but we'll just have to see how it goes. <laughs> yep. The great master of whom you speak boasts a skill others can only dream of. Their pride and prestige don't phase us. The important thing is that I, on behalf of the Oni King and the Arataki Gang, can find a way to show them we're serious and sincere in our quest to master the mechanical arts. Okay. So I'll need to do some research to find out what kind of gift we should offer if we're to be seen as worthy of learning the mysteries behind the manufacturer of the Bloom Pruner. Hmm. Boss, we gotta leave right now or we're not gonna make it in time. <sighs> All right. I guess this is it. Aw, oh, don't be sad, Ita. Traveler, Paimon, mm -hmm. Yenfei Senpai, Miss Shengling, Woba. You've all been a huge help to boss with this beetle battle event. I really can't thank you enough. Don't mention it. Please, take this as a token of my gratitude. I hope you can find some use for it in your future endeavors. Wow, Thanks, Shinobu. Yeah. Thanks, Shinobu. You're so thoughtful. <laughs> Woohoo! <laughs> the time has come. Adios, compadre. See you, sky cleaving white iron lavender melon. Goodbye, Wobasan and Chef Sama. And farewell, my savior. I'll be back real soon. I promise. We'll meet again. La, 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 la. <laughs> Don't make promises you can't keep, Bull Chucker. Oh, yes. It's good to have ambitions, but don't let yourself get carried away in the heat of the moment. Do what Shinobu tells you. Be realistic about what you can achieve, and make sure you pace yourself. But of course, if everything works out, Paimon can't wait to see Crimson Staff driving a ginormous mechanical only Kabuto the next time we meet. A ginormous. Crystal Tornado? That's a actually. Huh? <laughs> Provisionally perpetual beetle battle. And it's raining. Great. I think the rain is telling like oh no. Beetle is going away. And he's sad. <laughs> not beetle battle. <laughs> to not do any beetle battling right now. Don't be sad. We'll be fine. Best flavor in the world? The sweet, sweet taste of victory. And that's why I've never spent a single more on any of my snacks. I've won them all, fair- uh. Hey there, Limo. How would you like to play another game with Groba? Still like to test Bloom from his chills. Uh, how- uh, First off, before we start with the fighting, okay? How are your preparations for reopening one Min restaurant? Oh, uh, things back at the restaurant aren't too busy, which is why Groba and I are free to play a few days. Thanks for the concern, though. We are almost we've almost completed restarting, so we should be back to business as usual in a few more days. Nice. If you and Paimon still haven't had enough, you're free to swing by for a meal any time. <laughs> okay, um, let's um, let's start this. The ultimate challenge. Oh, so that was only friendly spar. So that's why it was this easy. <sighs> All right. Okay. Fair enough. Focus. 
Focus fight. Let's get started. So good. Okay, so he's going to attack three times. Oh, jet stream. This was the focused one. Skies. All right. <laughs> As for the last. <clears throat> Most light. Let's do this. <clears throat> oh, my God. Uh... Ouch. Going to attach several times. One, two, three. One, two, three. One, two, three, four, five. Ow! <laughs> okay. Jet stream. Whew. Oh. Going slowly but surely, I'm going to go back. And twenty second. Don't underestimate the beetle. Completed. All right. Let's reap the rewards. The final rewards. That. Okay. So the Aratachi Blazing Armor Beetle Battle Bootcamp is done. We finished that. Didn't know that I will uh, have every single one of the challenges today. But hey, <laughs> there was there was seven days remaining, so I did I did it earlier, I suppose. It's great. It's clearly great. Well, let's go talk to guys Grandmaster Hanakado. Want to know what's on this beetle's diet? Sweat and tears, that- <clears throat> Oh great, Tony King's right hand. Is there anything I might assist with you with? Um... So, about the gist, that's- Yeah, that's right, I haven't even uh, looked at that yet. 
Oh, you mean the gist we're going to give to, to that great master? Oh, it's not the same one. To be, on to be honest, I haven't thought of any great ideas just yet. That master was able to create that incredibly intricate balloon printer. So perhaps I could buy some exquisite machine processing equipment and pack it into a diff box. It might be satisfactory. That said, I only have two million more on hand. So I doubt I'll be able to get my hands on the best stuff. It certainly wouldn't be good enough to catch that master's eye. Besides, I'm not sure how long I'll be here in Liwe, or and how much more I'll need for my own expenses. Gotta find some way to deepen my pockets. Uh, uh do I So there are two dialogue options here. Do I um Tell him is that is that money all you got since I about I have about like sixty three million more on my on my uh, on my side, or um, I act like um, <laughs> I'm out of the mora. Yeah, well, a small portion of it is my regular savings, but most of it was given to me by my grandfather. He used to be a great adventurer in the past, and he was blessed with good luck every time he took his own chapter with him, leading him to discover a large amount of treasures. That's why he greatly supports my beetle battling career. He deposits some funds for me every so often. Wow, it's quite generous. And I don't spend it willy nilly. One day, I want to use it on something super important. Earlier, I saw that the Aratashi Jan's finances were doing so hot, so I tried to support the other king with some funds, but he refused me every time, saying, I mean, hey, Aratashi Ito has his, pri has his pride, so of course he's going to refuse it. Nope, ain't no way will it, <laughs> nope, ain't no way will it in our allies pay. Me and the gang have backbone, I'll have you know. I respect that spirit, so when I do get that gift for that great master, I'll report those expenses to the only king, no matter how many millions of more it adds up to. Nice. Nice, nice. Before I, I talk to him about this next thing, I'm going to go back to join to my inventory here. Because we received something from... Uh, from... Uh, Shinobu right here. Aratachi Jane's instant ramen? I'm sorry. Okay. Um. <laughs> what? Uh, a gift from Kuchi Shinobu. After helping the bonafide Beetle Battle Team power up, and find new ways in Beetle Battle in our Tachi Blazing Armor Beetle Battle Bootcamp. <laughs> uh, dried ramen blocks are placed in the sturdy late yet light bars, with sealed condiments, exceptionally rigid utensils, and, and a bowl. Put the ramen and the condiments in the bowl, then pour in hot water to quickly make a bowl of ramen that doesn't tastes too bad at all. Convenient, isn't it? But according to the letter that Chuji Shinobu left in the box, neither she nor Aratachi Ito got to eat this during their journey in the water to Liwe. Because they only brought Chuji's and pickles. During their stay in Liwe, Chuji Shinobu was inspired by the wheaten, the, the, yeah, the wheaten foods there and created this instant ramen so that only Chin's right hand and sky cleaning white iron lavender lamp lavender melon <laughs> could fight off their hunger during their travels. Aww, that's so sweet, Kuchi Shinobu. Thank you very much. And of course, with the help of the Oni Jane himself. That was amazing. That was amazing. Wow. 
Okay. <laughs> yeah. I, I, I couldn't help but having a smile on my face this whole time. This is so wholesome. <laughs> Alright. Let's talk to Aunt Hanakado again. Um, get me an Onichabuto. Of course, that is well within my abilities. However, it takes some time to assess their compatibility between an Onichabuto and a mighty beetle battler. I've been able to guess more or less which sort of which sort of Onichabuto would suit your fighting style based on your on our previous battles. Of course, that's been quite a test of my abilities too. The matter where I should go to capture such an early character is something I must give much thought to. I will have to ask for your patience in this matter. Next we meet, I'll have the perfect answer ready for you. So, our next Beetle Battle Boot Camp, we're going to have our own unique only Chabuto, given to us or provided by Grandmaster Hanakado. Dimmy dimmy. And you too, it changed right hand. It is me, Arataki Ito, numero uno Ito, only chains, bolt shutter. I defeated all of these challenges around me. And I'll be back. The, world, the sweet, sweet taste Shush. of Shush! And that's why. Ahem. <clears throat> yeah, let me, let me replace it. And I'll be back. Don't you dare forget me. I'll be back. And I'll get better. I'll be the one and only. Arutachi Ito. Beetle Battle Boot Champ Master. <laughs> wow. It's been a, a great. It's been amazing to say the least. And since it's uh, in a leeway. It gives me much more to, to expect from the uh, Lantern Ride Festival this year. And I hope you guys will be along for the ride when that happens. So yeah. On to other things, I guess. <laughs>